My full name is Radu Stefan Revutsky. I'm from uh, Moldova and I've been uh, living in Washington DC for around my high school and middle school years. I actually applied to Carnegie Mellon in uh, Pittsburgh and then I applied to a few other American universities there and CMUQ was the only university I applied to outside of the US. It was a difficult decision between my state school and uh, CMUQ but I decided to come here and so far I have no regrets. On my first day in CMU on the actual CMU campus was the first day of orientation and um, was a bit overwhelming, a bit intimidating but very fun to see a lot of different cultures mixed into this one place. My first impression of the students was that it was, um, we have a, we're gonna have a very big diverse community of people here. The people were very nice, first of all. We, Qatar has a lot of Westerners in general, a lot of foreign people, so they're very nice in general because they want to meet new friends and meet new people from around the world. So I like that, the people are very nice. It was easy to make friends, to start conversations with everyone else. The professors are, were also, um, gave me very good first impressions because they, uh, they seem very well informed and very interested in the, the topics in the major that I'm pursuing. So in computer science, they seem very knowledgeable and very interested and um, very willing to help the students. The most surprising thing was, I don't know, there's quite a few surprising things. I haven't been to the Middle East before. The entire, the entire culture of the Middle East, the way people are more, our people are more indirect when they speak, the way uh, the country is more conservative, the way um, the way people just, the, the ways that people have fun on a daily basis as compared to the United States and Europe was very different for me, but I've uh, started to enjoy it a lot because it's um, kind of, I've dived into a completely different culture. Seeing and experiencing how people live here and how they go out and have fun and all of these things has been uh, very interesting and surprising and has taught me a lot. Um, about the Middle East and about uh, the culture here. I've had to start all of my uh, relationships from scratch because I had, I did not know a single person here when I came. And um, so far, it's the we we've had a lot of fun together. I have friends from from Turkey, from Canada, Pakistan, uh, a lot of different nationalities from uh, the Middle East and um, Asia. So we've met a lot of, I've met a lot of uh, people like that and we've become close friends. We usually go out, when we go together to have fun, we go to downtown, to West Bay. Um, we either take a, the Dow on the water or we go driving around. Sometimes we'll go to the desert and we'll uh, drive around, go off-roading there a bit. Um, in addition to that, it's, you're not confined to the CMU Q community. Around DC, we, I've met a lot of people from an even more diverse group of nationalities. I've met people from uh, Moldova, Ukraine, Romania, and, um, and it's been nice to get to know a lot of these different nationalities and to become close friends with people who are studying at different universities. The advice I would give is have something that you're interested in pursuing and, um, and come here without the fear that it's not going to happen because Anything is possible here in Qatar Foundation, Education City, um, and it's a place for the students.